the volume of metal sphere increases by 0.30 percent when its temperature is raised by 50 degrees Celsius. Now, what is given here? The volume of metal sphere increases by 0.30 percent means change in volume upon original volume multiplied by 100 percent that is percentage change in volume and it was given as 0 0.30 percent. 0 0.30 percent means it is 0 0.3 divided by 100. 0 0.3 divided by 100. Now, temperature is raised by means a change in temperature del theta it is equal to 5 degrees Celsius. Now, the coefficient of linear expansion of the metal is coefficient of linear expansion which we denote by alpha that we have to calculate. We know by definition what is that? alpha equal to C here change in volume per in volume coefficient of cubical expansion coefficient of cubical expansion is denoted by gamma and that coefficient of cubical expansion it is defined as change in volume per unit original volume per degree rising temperature per degree rising temperature that is equal to delta V by V is 0 0.3 divided by 100 0 0.3 divided by 100 and what is this delta theta delta theta it is equal to 50 degree Celsius so into 50 because temperature rises by 50 degree Celsius so 0 0.3 upon 100 into 50 so if you calculate it it is 0 0.3 upon 5 into 10 to the power 3 or it is equal to 6 into 10 to the power minus 5 per degree centigrade per degree centigrade but here we have to find out this is the value of gamma coefficient of cubical expansion but we want to find out coefficient of linear expansion and we know the relationship between linear expansion and coefficient of cubical expansion that alpha is equal to gamma by 3 or gamma is equal to 3 alpha gamma is equal to 3 alpha gamma is known to us that is 6 into 10 to the power minus 5 upon 3 so 3 ones are 3 twos are that is 2 into 10 to the power minus 5 per degree celsius so the correct option for this question is 2 into 10 to the power minus 5 per degree Celsius. So, D is the correct option for this question. D is the correct option for this question.